Can you guys tell me the 10 best cartoon characters in TV history according to Ranker? Oh, well, according to them, I can tell them, tell them according to me. I'll go first. Go ahead. SpongeBob SquarePants. That's number five. That's yeah. messed up already. The bracket's busted. Well, the obvious number one is Bender from Futurama. <laughs> Not there. Tell me Peter Griffin. Not there. That's messed up too. This is, I don't even care about this list anymore. Go ahead. Are they like, does it lean little kids? It leans old cartoons. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Show me Ren and or Stimpy. Not there. <laughs> How about Charlie Brown? Not there. I guess that started as a comic. I, it still works, I think. Mm -hmm. Pinky and or The Brain? Not there. You what can't the keep hell? doing these double guesses. It's just the title of the show. <laughs> show me Twister from Rocket Power? No. Really? Old. Bart Simpson or... Yeah, Bart. I'm going to Bart. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, Scooby Doo. That's four. Mm. Oh, okay. Homer Simpson. That's nine. Okay. <laughs> Bugs Bunny. That's three. Nice. Garfield. Not there. Barney. Don't know if it counts as a cartoon. How about Barney? Not there. Why would it count as a cartoon? <laughs> I don't know. I could never really tell if it was like real or animated. <laughs> it's confusing, you know. Um, show me Mickey Mouse. That's eight. Okay. All right. How about Tweety Bird? Not there. Ah. Elmer Fudd? No. Donald Duck? No. Mickey Mouse? Or Minnie Mouse, I meant? <laughs> Not there. Uh. Show me Greg from Over the Garden Wall. Not there. That's wrong. Again. Show me Stewie Griffin? Not there. <laughs> I thought maybe. I don't know. Timmy Turner? No. Timmy, Timmy, Timmy Turner. The you wish it for a burner. <laughs> Can you hear anybody walking? Uh, show me the cart man. Not there. Daffy Duck? That's seven. Oh. Snoopy? That's six. Oh. Show me better version of Snoopy, Brian Griffin? Not there. When he speaks and he, he drinks martinis and votes liberal. Is Betty Boop on here? No. Oh, is like Fred Flintstone on here? No. Mm. Interesting. How about George Jetson? Not there. How about Tom and or Jerry? That is one and two. Oh, oh really? Nice. Yeah. <laughs> wow. The Pink Panther? No. Wiley Coyote? No. Roadrunner? No. <sighs> Yosemite Sam? No. What's the, what is it, Martian? What's his name? The little Mars guy? The Martian, yeah. Is that his name, Martian? Yeah. Martian. No. Are we in like the Looney Tunes, Warner Brothers kind of realm? I believe this is Warner Brothers. Okay. Oh, Michael Jordan. <laughs> no. From Space Jam. This is awesome in Space Jam. <laughs> Rick and Morty. No. <laughs> not now. No way. <laughs> I'm sorry. Absolutely not. I'm sorry. Oh, is it Graydon's look like Shaggy? It is Shaggy at 10. Whoa. <laughs> wow. That guy loved eating. Smoking too. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. It's all like mysteries. Yeah, well, that was the top 10 best cartoon characters of all time, according to Ranker. What are your top 10 best cartoon characters of all time? Comment them. Bye. Now. Can you guys tell me the 10 best comedy movies of all time, according to Ranker? Oh, yes, I would love to. Uh, the Mask. Not there. Jim Carrey's The Mask? Oh, <laughs> so scary. I felt like we were living in that movie for a few years there. <laughs> Caddyshack. That's four. Yeah. I know, it's gonna skew old, I think. No, 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 Okay, skewing old. Let's go with like some Mel Brooks. Let's show me Blazing Saddles. That's number one. Oh, yeah. Everybody loves that one. What in the wide world of sports is going on here? And then a bunch of racist stuff. Uh, how about Airplane? That's three. Okay. We're on fire. Yeah, we sure are. Hello. There's got to be a National Lampoon's on here. Maybe like Christmas Vacation. That's two. It is Christmas Vacation too? That's two. Yeah. Chevy I mean, Chase. That's the one. That's yeah. the one that everybody talks about. Talk about racism. All right. Still thinking old classics. Let's go with Bridesmaids. Not there. Huh? Oh, let's go even further back. Show me Super Bad. That's five. <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> Mel Brooks again? Genius. <laughs> <laughs> yep. How about Groundhog's Day? Not there. Okay. Maybe Basketball? Not there. <laughs> that movie. That's a classic. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ooh, show me one that's in my personal top five. How about Hot Rod? Not there. Really? Too niche. Are we sure? He double checked. Okay. Um, show me one that's more of a romance to me, but some people get a kick out of it. Shrek? 
That's eight. Yes. <laughs> Shrek's on there. <laughs> makes sense. Yeah, that is, I mean, fantastic movie. He's green, and that's what's funny. I think, yeah, that's the part that makes me laugh, at least. <laughs> Look at him, he's green. It's so funny. Oh, okay, yeah, we gotta have some Vince Owen action in here. I'm gonna go with Wedding Crashers. Not there. <sighs> um, Vince is in it. Show me Anchorman. Not there. Ooh. How about The Hangover? Not there. The Hangover Part 2? No. The Hangover 3, Honeymoon? No. <laughs> okay. Is it Deadpool? That's 10. Deadpool's the 10th, 10th funniest movie of all time. Yeah, I mean, that's just not true. Is that Ryan Reynolds? Yeah, Ryan Reynolds is Deadpool. Nothing funny about him, besides his acting. And that he's married to Blake Lively, and Blake is a boy's name. That's not funny. Funny to me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I feel like there's got to be a Will Ferrell, and I feel like, I mean, Elf? Is Elf on here? No. <sighs> Nothing funny about Christmas. It's a pagan holiday. It's not a pagan. It's like, a, it's a Christian holiday. Look it up, buddy. Do your research. Is Coneheads on here? No. Oh. What about Scary Movie 3? Not there. That's the one where they pee out of their fingers, and I feel like they should kind of rethink the list. That's pretty funny. Yeah. Show me space balls. That's nine. <laughs> <laughs> I just seen it because it's funny. It is a funny movie, though. Come on. Have you ever seen it? Yes, I've seen it's it. It's pretty funny. I mean, it's, I guess. Show me Austin Powers. Not there. Oh, really? Ooh, show me the Titanic. Not there. <laughs> what? There's no room on the door. <laughs> it's not, that's not a comedy, man. It's, it's not... funny because he's poor and he dies at the end. <laughs> <laughs> it's not, that's not. <laughs> and she lives. She's talking to the submarine people like, oh, he really rocked my britches. <laughs> There's Leonardo DiCaprio. That stuff's hilarious. He dangles her off the boat, too, in the one scene. That's, he's not dangling her. He's <laughs> oh, yeah, not, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's not what he's doing. Yeah, yeah. It's like a romantic thing. He's from, he says he's king of the world or whatever. All right, Elf wasn't here. Show me Step Brothers. That's six. Yes. Help me, Step Bro. No, that's, that's not. That's John C. Riley says, no, Joe? No, it's in the not. One scene? Uh uh. Oh, I love that It's stuff, a different, man. different <laughs> one that, that you watch. How about Con Air? Not there. Really? How about Office Space? Not there. Too dry. Yeah, but some people say that's the best comedy ever made. That is good. Grant Ace Ventura here? No. I agree Jim Carrey's probably on here. Mm-hmm. Uh, show me the new season of The Price is Right. Not there. Wrong Carrey. Oh, Carrey, that's that's more of a horror movie, right? Is it a European gigolo? Not there. <clears throat> ah, fun with Dick and Jane. Not there. Ah, uh, yeah. The movie was terrible. So yes, it makes it was. sense that it wouldn't be on there. Oh, <laughs> show me Vanilla Sky. Not there. <laughs> What's well, real? It's classic. It's not funny. It's like a two hour funny. bit. There's nothing funny about it. <laughs> Penelope Cruz? Come on. Uh, show me what some people call our show, Dumb and Dumber. <laughs> That's seven. <laughs> That's really <laughs> seven. <laughs> wow. Yeah. This list is pretty bad. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it has the old classics on there, but as far as new movies go, I'll take Step Brothers and Shrek and then the rest, whatever. Give me Dumb and Dumber 20 times over with Spaceballs playing at the same time. All right. Let us know what your favorite comedy movies of all time are and what else we should do. And we're Hive Mind. Look us up on YouTube. Check it out. Can you guys tell me the 10 best action movies of all time according to IMDb? Lights. Camera. Action. <laughs> that was action. You got me. <laughs> all right. Let me start this off with yeah. uh, Pulp Fiction. Not there. Wow. Is that considered like a straight action movie? I guess not, you know? Yeah. You know what? I'm going to piggyback off him, though. Okay. Give me Tarantino's best, Kill Bill 2, and as a qualifier, let's throw in Kill Bill 1 and or 3. Not there. Damn. Kill Bill 1, 2, and 3 aren't there. No. You guys are forgetting some obvious ones. Show me Hurt Locker. Not there. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Jeremy Renner's Hurt Locker. I do not understand that. Show me Die Hard. That's two. All right. There we go. It's a Christmas movie, but whatever. <laughs> it is, yeah. What about Terminator 1 and 2? That's 1. Okay. Ooh. Which one? 1. Right. 2 is 1. 2 is 1. 2 right. is 1. Yeah. I actually like the first one better. The Born Supremacy. Not there. Show me any of the John Wick movies. Not there. Wow. What about Grindhouse? Not there. Show me uh, Karate Kid. Not there. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there's action in it, let's be honest. <laughs> Show me my big fat Greek wedding. 
Okay. Not there. Yeah. Oh, yeah, love that movie. <laughs> a lot of action at a wedding. You know what I'm yeah, talking yeah. about? Yeah. <laughs> Guess Wedding Crashers. No. Okay. What about The Matrix? Not there. That's 14. Oh, I was mm. going to guess that. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Ah, show me Lethal Weapon. Not there. Good answer. Mm. I was thinking Lethal Weapon 5, but... Yeah. <laughs> Show me the Matrix's uh, less popular but more acclaimed spin-off, The Real World. Not there. I would like kind of like the Matrix aesthetically, but cooler. Blade. Not there. How about the most popular modern silent movie, Drive? Not there. I know it's not totally silent, but Ryan Gosling has like five lines and it's basically just a chromatics album. Yeah. <laughs> uh, let me just throw a shot in the dark here with uh, The Dark Knight. Not there. Indiana Jones count? That's five. Yeah, I mean, hey, big old rock going at it. That, that'll get you spring into action. <laughs> More like Harrison Board. God, I was yawning during that one. Really? Yeah, I hate it. Uh, show me Mission Impossible. That's six. Yes, Riley. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I saw Mission Impossible, maybe it was four. I don't remember which one it was, at a drive-in theater when I was 18. Yes. With a, a sweet sweetie of mine. Yes. Time. Yeah, hey, hey, relax. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Keep going. All right. I, I thought it was like a joke. Like, I didn't understand that it was just like people dying in like 35 different ways. That's yeah. really all that happened. <laughs> one is amazing, though. Yeah, I mean, hey, I didn't yeah. see, I, I there wasn't a plot line that I needed to follow. There's like a million movies for this, so I'll just use this umbrella term of James Bond. Not there. Damn. Speaking of a million movies, show me Fast and the Furious. Not there. Show me Wild Hogs. Hmm. Not there. Show me my parents' divorce tape. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> That's seven. <laughs> uh, it's not. Yeah. It's not. It's, it's not, not there. there. No, it's not. Right. Is Mad Max here? That is four. Yeah. Um, Witness me. <laughs> uh, show me Pacific Rim. Not there. It sounds so good. I mean, so the surround sound. I mean, it's yeah. just crazy. I mean, the what visuals. A, yeah. Yeah. It's not really that great of a movie, but show me Watchmen. Not there. I like that movie. It was okay. What about RoboCop? Not there. Ooh, good answer. Shout out to Troy. What about Reservoir Dogs? Not there. Show me Kindergarten Cop? <laughs> Not there. What about Aliens? That's three. Wow. There's a movie just called Aliens? Yeah. <laughs> really? It's pretty epic. Oh. You'd like it. I don't it's think so. It's got love. It's got loss. Oh, a lot of rap music. Um, gambling. Like um, gambling. Oh, uh... Old baseball players are in it. Love that. Absolutely. Yeah. Like, how old are we talking? Oh, uh, like we're talking 90s. Seiko? 90s. Like, steroid era, guys. Uh, I like that, but yeah. I would like to go a little further back. You okay. Know? Yeah. Clemente and folks. Roger Clemens? Roger Clemens is awesome. I mean, yeah. the ERA. I mean, he had the lowest ERA <laughs> since the Civil War. Yeah. I, mean, <laughs> I mean, it was unbelievable. Oh, uh, show me Little Miss Sunshine. Not there. What the f <laughs> Isn't there like a car crash or something in that movie? I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I was just, whatever, man. I haven't seen enough movies. I get it. Okay, I know there's a cop movie in this one, so I'm going to go with Narco. Not there. I'm going to stick with your theme here, Brad. Show me old hard-boiled. That's seven. <laughs> <laughs> that's the name of a movie? Yeah, that's like a dad's favorite. <laughs> if your dad's like a, a cool guy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Sounds to me like the name of an egg. <laughs> <laughs> Show me one of my favorite movies of all time, Zodiac. Not there. Oh, I don't know if that's really an action movie. There's a lot of killing in it. It's though. good. And it's really, really good. I mean, we're talking Mark Ruffalo, Jake Gyllenhaal at their best. Ruffalo! Show me Too Young to Die. It's Not a, there. It sounds like an action movie. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I wish I could show it. We have a model of his gun that he uses. Show me Dirty Harry. That's eight. Yeah. Oh, good job. There you go. Nice. Show me another Clint Eastwood one. Problem with the curve? <laughs> Not there. Awesome. Flick. <laughs> oh, yeah. Show me the uh, classic Steve Carell action movie, Get Smart. Not there. Uh -huh. There's a Steve Carell action movie, huh? Yeah, he's like a yeah. spy whiz with gadgets. Yeah, right? something like that, yeah. Yeah. And I think it's like based off of an old TV show. Show me Black Hawk Down. Not there. Black cock down. Come on, Brad. Brad, Brad come on. Brad. Brad. Stop. Stop. Stop it, Brad. Stop. Give it a rest, Brad. Speaking of a rest, show me End of Watch. Not there. Oh, great cop movie with Jake Gyllenhaal. At his best. Show me the classic animated hamster action movie, G-Force. Not there. 
Good guess. Good mm -hmm. guess, Brad. Speaking of great animated action movies, show me Killer Bean. Not there. What? <laughs> when he like busts it down oh and the bean's gosh. like going in, they're like. <laughs> Earlier, somebody said something about a TV show adaptation. Did they ever make a Starsky and Hutch movie? Not there. They did, and it was bad. I think uh -huh. Owen Wilson was in it. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Show me Too Old to Die. Not there. Uh, yeah. That's a good, <laughs> Damn it. That's a great movie. Um, I'm going to give a shout out to my roommate Wags here, always trying to show me The Raid or The Raid 2. That's nice. Yes. Oh, wow. Apparently, okay. like some of the best fighting choreography ever. He showed me the first 15 minutes countless times, and I can't make it through. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Show me Rambo. Not there. Ooh. See, that's surprising that Rambo isn't there. Yeah. Show me two middle-aged to die. Not there. <laughs> All right. Damn it. All right. All right. I, Let's throw the I think we're tapped. What's the last one, Grant? The last Boy Scout with Bruce. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> the last Boy Scout? What is that? The last Boy Scout. Bruce Willie. All right, those are the 10 best action movies according to IMDb. Thank you, Brad Taste and Music, for being here. Everybody go subscribe to him on YouTube. We're hot, mud. You guys tell me the 10 best animated movies of all time according to Ranker. Ooh, let's get animated. Yep. Show me Toy Story. That's four. Show me Toy Story 2. Not there. Show me The Lion King. That is number one. I'd like to see Toy Story 3. Not there. <laughs> I've never seen it. I'd love to see it. Oh, okay. I'm going to stay with Pixar. Go Finding Nemo. That is six. Nice, Riley. Gosh, I love that movie so much. It's in the running to be my favorite Pixar movie. I'm still deciding, though. I'm going to watch all of them, and then I'm going to rank them. Oh, wake up. Holy smokes. Um, bah, bah, bah. What about Snow White? No, not there. <laughs> well, in that same vein, when the snow is white, show me Frozen. Not there. Okay, I want to build a snowman. <laughs> Let it go, let it go. <laughs> oh, wow. I lost it there, sorry guys. I was never gonna be Elsa, I knew it. I wanna see Soul. Not there. How about The Incredibles? That is five. Above Finding Nemo, I will take that into consideration when making my list of Pixar movies. What about The Incredibles 2? Not there. Come on, man. <laughs> Some of these sequels are better. How about Into the Spider-Verse? That's eight. Okay. What about Childish Gambino's Lion King? Not there. Are you kidding me? It's not really like fully animated, is it? <laughs> That's how good the animation was, cuz. <laughs> <laughs> how about uh, Fantasia? No. Is that what it's called? I yeah. don't know. <laughs> 2001. What about uh, Fantastic Planet? Not there. Really? A 1970s art French film? <laughs> Despicable Me. Not there. Despicable You. What about Akira? No. Oh, how about Spirited Away? Not there. What about Ghost in the Shell? Not there. So there's no adult movies on the list. Depends it's... on how you view it, you know? Mm. Sausage Party. Yeah, not there. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because they have sex. Well, it's funny because it's an awful movie. I remember liking it. I haven't seen it in a long time. Yeah. I saw it in theaters with my grandparents. The last movie they saw. <laughs> How about Tarzan? Not there. That should be on there. Yeah. That's fantastic. He's so sexy. Phil Collins or? Whoever plays Tarzan in that. Oh, it's animated, so I don't know. Nobody really play. I'm sure somebody voiced him, but Phil Collins does the music. Sure does. <laughs> Genesis. <laughs> Those songs are so good. Yeah. I want to know, can you show me? I want to know about these strangers like me. Speaking of singing, let's get down to business. Give me Mulan. Not there. What? That has to be on there. That's like quintessential Disney. Oh, you know what they always say is so good? What? How to Train Your Dragon. That is nine. Oh, yeah. People do say that one's really good. I haven't seen it, so I'm not going to judge. You saw it? And? Didn't work. I'll tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't work? Like, yeah. what were you expecting it to do? It was Train my dragon. Oh. <laughs> All right. Well, just say he's still breathing fire. <laughs> How about Beauty and the Beast? Not there. What about Hotel for Dogs? Nope. <laughs> is that even animated? Yes. I don't think it is. Whatever. It looked like it to me. I was on shrooms. <laughs> <laughs> They're decriminalized in our state. We can say that on TikTok. 
Okay, well, in that case, show me Vanilla Sky. <laughs> <laughs> Could have that thing was in. I don't know. Something was moving. <laughs> what about Lego Star Wars? <laughs> Not there. That's crazy, bro. Uh, how about Little Mermaid? Not there. Second Pokemon movie? No. Okay. Cinderella? Not there. Beauty and the Beast? No. I already guessed that. Oh, you did? Yeah, Tales All This Time. It was like four guesses ago. The teacup? Yeah, be our guest. <laughs> be our guest. Okay, I'll guess something new. All right. Give me something to guess. <laughs> Wait. You took my guess. You took my guess. Um, Grant, show me Fox and the Hound. Not there. Show me Aristocats. Not there. <laughs> what the heck? 10 million and one Dalmatians? No. It's just 101. Oh, really? Yeah. I have numbers. Once they get more than two digits, I kind of just guess. Yeah. <laughs> Might as well be 10 million to me. So wait, I'm not a billionaire? No, not uh, even close. I don't even know if you're a hundred air right now. You uh, asked me for 30 bucks for lunch. I saw a comma. Show me inside out. Not there. What about Ratatouille? <laughs> not there. Not even pronounced like that, but that's okay. <laughs> Show me Shrek. That is seven. The number eight best comedy of all time is number seven on the animated movies list. Yeah. That makes no sense. Are you going to throw up? You look like you're going to pass out, maybe. Graham, what are we still looking for? Looking for two, three, and ten. Show me Stuart Little. Not there. Also not animated. He is animated, bro. Okay, but that doesn't count as an animated movie. Hugh Laurie's in that movie. But if you take the animation out of it, it's a kid... Talking to nothing. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you got me there. You can have a kid talking to nothing. Show me Winnie the Pooh. Not there. Is that, they even make that a movie? Yeah. Oh. Right? What about Jackass 3D? <laughs> Not there. I'm giving up on you. Uh, Monsters, Inc. That is two. Yes. Yes. I'm going to also put that in my consideration when I'm going to make the ranking of the Pixar movies. How about Crocodile Dundee? Nope. Okay. Oh, Peter Pan. Not there. What? Jaws. No. Shark Tale. Nah. Happy Feet. Not there. Show me Aladdin. That is 10. Oh, is Eight Crazy Nights on here? Not there. That's a technical foul. <laughs> a technical foul. Can you show me Paddington? Not there. What about Paddington 2? No. Marcel the Shell? No. Shrek 2. No. Is up on here? That is three. Yeah. Spoiler alert, he dies. Wait, come <laughs> on. You don't got to do that. Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> Hello. Why are you doing that? There's so many kids watching. Death. Last thing I'll say is I'm going to take that into consideration when making my Pixar list. <laughs> okay? All right. Those were the top 10 animated movies of all time, according to Ranker. What are the top 10 animated movies of all time, according to you? And check us out on YouTube. Hive Mind. Bye. Can you guys tell me the 10 highest grossing reality shows of all time? I would love to. Would you like to go for a chat on the day beds? The Bachelor. That's eight. Eight? Uh-oh. How about The Real World? Not there. Hmm. Survivor. That's six. Oh, there's gonna be a bunch of shows that count. I'm thinking of like straight love reality, like lust and love. And I gotta think more in like the Gordon Ramsay realm you know what i mean mm -hmm. what's his biggest show hell's kitchen not there amazing race not there not so amazing uh america's next top model not there is that really even reality i think that's more of a competition show let's try it out as american idol here that is seven. Oh, so those ones do count oh yeah the voice that's number one nbc's the voice i mean it is a smash hit show me the masked singer not there good yeah, that's good. It's probably creeping up there, though. That show sucks. Ooh, um, ooh, 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 X Factor. Not there. Really? Dancing with the Stars? Not there. That's crazy. I really thought that would be there. Jersey Shore? Not there. Mm. Um, Jersey Shore's not gonna be on there. Okay, well, he just said it wasn't, so you don't have to, like, rub it in. <laughs> don't make me feel bad for guessing something. You got a bunch of wrong guesses, too. No, I did. I got two. Whatever. Oh, Love Island gonna be here? I sure hope it is. You don't sound like that. I'm sorry. So it's more of a <laughs> um, My bad, man. I came at you sideways and you didn't deserve it. Uh, oh, River Monsters. Not there. That's 
Be gone and all. They had to stop the show. I'm Grant. Is Love Island going to be there? I sure hope it is. It's not. <laughs> Man. Uh, there's so many seasons and they got so many episodes. Oh, watch me. I'm going to be you. Show me the best show of all time, Ink Master. That's not there. Oh, it definitely should be. <laughs> <laughs> Boom! <laughs> Uh, show me gambling every day. <laughs> Not there. Yeah, you crossed the line. You crossed the line. <laughs> That's my last straw. If it is your last straw, you should just bet it. See if you can get five. <laughs> it's usually a three straw minimum. Okay, whatever. <laughs> is the apprentice on here? That is three. Boom! You fired. <laughs> you fired. <laughs> you fired. Because you're a woman. <laughs> You're fired because you're gay. <laughs> and you, get out. You're a minority. You're fired too old, not hot enough anymore. <laughs> you're just not hot enough. We're doing like the Jimmy Fallon yeah. Donald Trump impression there, but that's fine. The Bachelorette. Not there. I bet it falls under the Bachelor franchise. Cake Boss. <laughs> not there. Bam. Is Chopped on here? No. Iron Chef. <laughs> not there. The Great American Bake Off, or whatever it's called. No. Okay. Are there any cooking shows? Yes. Rachel Ray! Not, <laughs> not there. Is it Top Chef? That is five. Wow. Chef, I need some top. And yeah, she cooks up some really good top. That girl. Sorry. <laughs> heck, I'm talking about Jeremy Allen White and his sexy biceps. You're over here talking about getting top. That's all I can talk about. He got a divorce, and now he's... A city boy, city boys up. City boys up. <laughs> city boys up one. five points. Yes, Jeff. You know what I mean. And goo goo gaga. All right, <laughs> um, back into it. Is Jeopardy on here? It is not. How about Keeping Up with the Kardashians? That's ten. Only number ten. Wow. Yeah. I would think it would be higher. Can't believe I didn't think of it first. What's that? I don't know. I'm trying to look crazy. <laughs> I'm trying to get us more views. <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> I think you look crazy enough as is. People like that kind of stuff, though, man. Trust me. Ooh, guess sexy beasts. The one where they dress up as like in crazy makeup and date each other. I'm not gonna do that. That's a prank. Um, speaking of pranks, show me punked. No, <laughs> not there. <laughs> That's a crazy guess. <laughs> crazy. <laughs> City cribs. I might. Extreme makeover home edition. Not there. Come on. Show me pigs. No. Oh, sorry. I mean, show me cops. Not there. I was brave of you. Thank you. <laughs> Live swine PD. <laughs> oh, uh, show me Breaking Bad. Not there. Oh. I told you a thousand times that was not a real show. It seemed pretty real. I don't know how you fake that. All right. Is America's Got Talent on this? That's nine. That's what I was thinking of with X Factor, I think. I meant. <laughs> what? <laughs> Isn't X Factor like, what's X Factor? X Factor is hosted by Joe Rogan. No, that's Fear Factor. <laughs> <laughs> You're out of your mind. X Factor. X Factor is the British version of America's Got Talent. Baloney. It is. Simon Cowell started X Factor. That's how One Direction got formed. Yeah. The British version of America's Got Talent isn't just British Got Talent. No, America's Got Talent was made after it. Just X like Factor. The Office? Yes. X Factor is like Ricky Gervais' office. America's Got Talent is like Steve Carell office. Speaking of The Office, The Office. Not there. That one's real, right? It's real good. Okay. Um, how about Bar Rescue? Not there. Ooh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Is Dr. Steve-O here? Not there. <laughs> Never made it to the air. Oh, really? Yeah. I've seen him make it to the air plenty of times. That dude goes flying off of stuff. And it's all sorts of wacky shenanigans he gets into. We're going to destroy everything you love because you're a fucking nerd. <laughs> <laughs> That's Dr. Steve-O's premise, yeah. basically, like, this guy can't talk to girls, and so we're gonna beat the shit out of him and have him walk over broken glass. <laughs> Is RuPaul's Drag Race here? That's four. Let's go to work. Oh, to <laughs> work. I'm gonna demon drop for TikTok. Yeah, go for Oh, my back. <laughs> Help me up. Get me back in the chair. Uh, I don't know. Get me back in the chair. Seems like it could be a prank. I don't want to get pranked. <laughs> Boots the house, girl. Oh, thank you. Oh. Madonna stuns a new selfie. That's another reference. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Oh, I got an idea. Show me basketball wives. Not there. Oh. Really? Poker wives? 
No. Oh. Esports wives? No. Golf daddies? <laughs> Not there. Oh. Charcuterie uncles? Not there. Uh, how about, is it just real housewives? That's two. Oh, yeah, there's so many of them. They do Atlanta, Denver, Little Rock. Berlin. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, honey, don't go to Bergen again. <laughs> it's like, uh, get off my back, woman. I don't know why the German guy sounds like that. <laughs> whatever. If you guys like stuff like this, check us out on YouTube. <laughs> Say bye, Riley. I can't. He says bye. I'm bye. sorry. <laughs> you guys tell me the 10 most famous actors in the world right now. Ooh, right now. Go ahead. Most famous actors right now. Show me Tom Holland. Not there. <laughs> okay. Interesting. He's too small. Yeah. Can I do a twofer? I mean, what? Whatever. Uh, <laughs> Chris Hemsworth. That's seven. Yeah, hot. <laughs> now, some would be tempted to do another Hemsworth here, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to go with Dwayne The Rock Johnson. That's five. Four guys more famous than Dwayne right now? This was my other uh, one for the twofer. Show me the other Chris. Chris Evans. Not there. Chris Evans isn't there. I'll stay on the Chris train. Go. Chris Pratt. Not there. So oh, good looking and very, not that talented. Very good looking, not super talented. Was funny on Parks and Rec. <sighs> Seems to be a Republican. Oh, speaking of Parks and Rec, is Aziz Ansari on here? No. Mmm, that seems odd, doesn't it? <laughs> no, it doesn't. Yeah. It just makes Terrible total, actor. Makes total sense. Yeah. Who would cast their parents in their own show? Is Kevin Hart on here? No. <laughs> he does a lot of movies. He I don't, does. He, I don't know. Uh, let's keep it in the heart throbs. Uh, Pedro Pascal. That's three. Yeah. Oh. He is so, man, he is hot, hot, hot right now. Yeah. Uh, shall we Chief Hopper, David Harbour? <laughs> Not there. I don't know. Just thinking Netflix. Right, right. <laughs> Just thinking of Netflix, you know. Leonardo DiCaprio. That's two. I love saying his name. Oh, then I know number one. Will Ferrell. Not there. <laughs> oh, man. I am <laughs> off today, guys. I do not know. Mark Wahlberg here? No. Yeah. Stay prayed up. Brad Pitt. No. Robert Downey Jr. That's number one. Number one. Really? What? If, it's almost like, what have you done for me lately? You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I get it. Iron Man. Ten years ago. Yeah. Yeah. Grant, uh, show me Abel Tesfe, better known as The Weeknd. <laughs> Not there. Ted Ross. Have you seen The Idol? <laughs> he's got Biggest a big show. Yeah, he's got a big fat tongue, too. Yeah, you, you got a big fat tongue. Give me a hint, Grant. Um, Big court case. <laughs> Daniel Radcliffe, Harry Potter. No. Oh! <laughs> wow. Interesting. I know he got a bunch of weapons charges. That's why I guess that. Yeah. yeah. He had that stick on him. And, and it wasn't a wand. Public indecency as well. <laughs> yeah. At the same time, he, he was, was wielding. Yeah. That's what they say. He also, in an interview, once said that he has a hamster penis. A tiny little penis. Is it said. looks like a hamster or it's the size of a hamster's? Gotta ask Daniel. Don't right. ask me. Grant, show me Ryan Reynolds. That's 10. Yeah, that makes sense. I mean, Deadpool owns a soccer team with Mac from Always Sunny. Really popping off right now, yeah. That's going to get you on the list. <laughs> yeah, good luck, Chuck. That was Dane Cook. That's who I, was, yeah, I always get them mixed up. <laughs> I guess Dane Cook. No. Okay. Show me Daniel Day-Lewis. Not there. Wow. Mm. What about Tom Cruise? Not there. What How about Johnny Depp? That's four. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. How about Clooney? No. George Clooney. No. <laughs> no? Casamigos? No. Uh, <sighs> Timothy Chalamet? That's nine. Mm. Surprised it took us so long. I guess Tom Holland, his uglier counterpart. Yeah. Couldn't think of Timmy. Oh, show me Matthew Broderick. Not there. What? He had his big day off. Yeah, Ferris Bueller's big day off. Is Morgan Freeman still alive? That's number eight. Cool. <laughs> I'll take it. I don't keep up with the celebrity gossip. Right, right. I don't know who's alive, who's passed. And to me, this big thing always keeps going on. No matter yeah. What, you know what I mean? Yeah. How about Denzel Washington? Not there. Oh, really? How about our next president, Matthew McConaughey? <laughs> Not there. Baloney. This one's a little weird because, eh, I don't know. He was in Cats. Give me James Corden. Not there. <laughs> Shoot. Um, give me his uglier counterpart, Frank Caliendo. Not there. Ah, he's great at impressions, though. Well, this one's kind of weird, but uh, he was in Cats. Show me Jason Derulo. Mm. 
Not there. Show me Will the Till Smith. That's six. Oh, yeah, Will Smith. Yeah. Did you know that he slapped Chris Rock at the Oscars? That's what I'm saying. I'm not really up on the gossip. I did not. It just happened. Was he good? It's up for debate. Some people say that it was completely unacceptable. Was he good at the slap, though? Was it a good slap? Oh, it was a good slap. Nice. Some say it was the slap heard around the world. Wow. Didn't make it to my ears. Thanks, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> See you in the next one.